Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. In recent times, Tejas has roared in the international sky during two air shows mesmerizing the audience with its acrobatic maneuvers. The first one was in Dubai Air Show held in the month of November last year and the latest one was in Singapore Air Show this month. During Singapore Air Show, Tejas has exhibited its ferry range exceeding 3000 kilometers with three drop tanks and non-stop flight from its Sulur Air Base in Tamil Nadu to Singapore. This is a significant capability for a light combat aircraft. Now the news regarding which we are going to talk about is going to be banal moment for the haters of light combat aircraft Tejas, especially those who are questioning why Tejas is not sent for combat missions. As you already know that Tejas has participated in multiple air shows and domestic war games and drills. But for the very first time, it will be showcasing its combat potential in Cobra Warrior, an international combat exercise which involves the fighters like F-35s and Eurofighter Typhoons. The International Air Combat Exercise Cobra Warrior 2022-1 is scheduled between 7th to 25th of March 2022 in United Kingdom. It is the Royal Air Force premier tactical training event aimed at developing the tactical skills for its aircrew and supporting elements in a composite air operation. This time, the countries which are going to participate in this exercise are United States, United Kingdom, Sweden, Saudi Arabia, Belgium, and India. As a part of this exercise, eight typhoons from Saudi Arabia Air Force, six Belgian F-16s, six Swedish Gripens, F-35s, and F-15s are expected to take part along with Indian fighter jets. Indian Air Force, for the very first time, will be fielding five F-4C LCA Tejas in this exercise along with four refuelers and supporting aircraft which could be C-130 and C-17s. As a part of this 5 days MK-1 will be deployed at Royal Air Force Weddington, United Kingdom to train alongside nations in this multilateral exercise that will see participants pitching for the most sophisticated combat platforms like F-35, F-15, Eurofighter Typhoons, etc. Indian Air Force will also build its supporting refueling aircraft C-130 and C-17. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.